funny. All right, here we go. All right, here's an interesting one. It's actually Japanese sake, but it's got a uh, kiwi fruit fermenting agent, I think, in it. Very interesting. And it's only 8 to 9%, so it's very low alcohol, and it's made in Niigata can. Oh. There we go. Wow. It's quite good, isn't it? Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Color is very clear. Mm. I thought it would be slightly green, but no. All right. Cheers. Okay. Here we go. Mm, very sweet flavor. Mm. Wow. It's not like sake. Not at all. Well, that's an interesting taste. Mm. God, the ladies want to get drunk. Mm. I think it really has a kiwi fruit taste. Mm. Interesting. If you like something sweet, that's good for you. Mm. Anyway, from Thank Niigata. Alright, so that's... So here's something we do at New Year in Japan. There's a little something called Otosu. And inside, if you unwrap it, there's a little bag like this. And we put it inside the sake, which is a New Year celebration sake, like this one. And um, you leave it overnight, releases its essence, I guess you'd say, into the bottle. And the next day you drink it and it changes the flavor. These are only available at New Year, so you'll have trouble finding it any other time. It's been brewing away with the uh, bag in it now, the spice bag, for about 10 hours or so. With the gold leaf in it, so I'll just mix up gold leaf as well as the bag in there just to make sure everything gets flowed through properly and here we go yellow color it's not from the gold by the way <laughs> but the gold floating around in there too so anyway it's just a normal sake it's nothing special but it's just to get this taste they have at the new year's mm. yeah yeah it's got a slightly kind of cinnamon tasty to it taste to it but um it probably needs just a, a little bit longer, like, you know, I left this during the day. It wasn't quite overnight into the next afternoon, so probably another five five hours or so to probably be fully infused into the uh, sake. But anyway, it's not bad. You get the normal sake taste, but you get a bit of a cinnamon taste to it, so it's very unusual. Um, if you can pick up those bags, uh, which I can't lay my hands on right now because I'm moving house right now. So this is just uh, just to fill in also. Again, this is something they use at New Year's, and it's just like a celebration sake, you know.